Yo, we got that new Andy Minio and new words played, and everybody been telling me to get on this words play, dude. So here we are. Roll it. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Channel's name is The Third Ernest. I'm Ernest Adiano The Third. Y'all guys, third family. If you're new here and you're not subscribed and you like what you see at the end of the video, consider becoming part of the family, clicking the subscribe button, bottom right hand corner. Now, I had been knowing about this little video or this little series or this style of creation that they were doing for these videos in terms of like the Japanese elements and the VH1 elements that go into it, like VH1 pop up video. And then on top of that, we got like, it's very popular in Japan to have like the screen of, of somebody like watching basically reacting to the video as it was being played real time the whole concept and the whole idea is just fire bro like when when, when i found out about this i was like yo this is about to be a bop this is about to be a video bop you know what i'm saying so that's the whole intro we about to get after it so follow your boy on instagram and on twitter at the third earnest just like the channel links in the description we got andy minio words played shibuya roll call let's get it Yeah. Yeah. My name Yo, this is already fire, dog. Like the the production is so chill. It's like lo-fi, but it's not lo-fi, but it is, but it like but it's not. It's fire. And then I'm 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 loving the little pop-up elements that are coming up like explaining things. It's tight. Yeah. My name is Andy. I'm from New York. I'm Italian. I got the sauce. I love yeah. my body, like a lot. I had some debt. I paid it. Look. In 2019, Andy racked up some good debt. There is such thing as good debt. Do be aware, not all debt is bad. So good debt is building your credit score. Now you're not falling behind. You're just using the debt as an asset to make more money. But he said, I, my name is Andy. I'm Italian. I got the sauce. <laughs> like like literally Italian dressing, like like spaghetti sauce, fettuccine sauce, because a very Italian thing to have sauce at the table side. He said, I love my wife like a lot. <laughs> Smart water on my rider. Yeah, I got a hard product. I ain't selling narcotic, just bars with a lot of yeah. purpose for those who hurt him. Bro, this is going to be hard to keep up with everything. Lyrics, what's popping up on screen. Now I know why he posted that on his IG saying to listen in these in this certain order so that way you uh so that way you can get the whole experience but it says smart water on my rider bro same if i had a rider that's where i would be i was smart water that's just, smart water or life water that's my thing smart water on my rider yeah i got a hard product i ain't selling narcotic just bars with a lot of yeah purpose for those who hurt him my flow off of something certain for those who thirst in this cold water i love you blessing on my end bro the flow, the delivery, just so like smooth and legato, not very like, not not very energetic. It's just like, it's riding the beat exactly as it should. Clean. Uh, my flow offers something certain for those who are hurting. It's like a glass of cold water, bro. And then he just started the bar with the smart water rider. Just the full circle nature of the bar. Fire. And did that say that homes lose their value? I'm from the United States, obviously. So homes always appreciate here, obviously, except for the recession and the Great Depression. But here, like a home is a good investment because it goes up in value. How does a house go down in value? For something certain, for those who thirst in this cold water. I love you. Blessing all my enemies when it's beef, let it's that's partly due to an opinion in Japan that new homes are less risky than old ones. Oh, it's just like a, it's like this thing in their head. They feel that new homes are worth more probably because of the technology and the build quality and all that. So if you hold a home for 10 years, in 10 years, someone's gonna be buying a new house, supposedly better quality. So that makes your house value less. That's, bro, that's crazy. That's crazy, I never knew that, that's dope. But he did say, blessing all my enemies. If it's beef, let us eat. Like if we beef in you and I, let's squash it so that we can break bread together fire blessing all my enemies when it's beef let us eat if i send shells they all fill with ricotta yeah ah. and words say oh shit bye bye then we break bread like the child i love you i literally just said break bread like he said it right there i didn't know that that was coming but that like you're breaking bread with your enemies it's fire and he said and if i send shells it's not going to be shell casings from bullets it's going to be shells filled with ricotta because again he's italian <laughs> that's dope bro like god life goes hit somebody with a real stunner if it doesn't happen for i go that's a real bummer yeah. uh, i'm assuming he's talking about the like a uh, stone cold stunner because he made that because he made that motion the business card like a ninja star i ain't trying to brag that's to say i came really far if you uh, got a dream don't sleep on it 
if you got a dream if you got a dream don't sleep on it bro like like you dream when you sleep but also if you got a dream don't sleep on it go out and get it yeah it's dope if you got a dream don't sleep on it if you got a dream don't sleep yeah if you got a dream don't sleep on it uh, if you got a dream don't sleep don't sleep yeah Man, and then they put the and then they put the little things in this on the screen, the pop up like annotations. And then as he's saying, if you got a dream, don't sleep. And they're talking about literally the jet lag that happens from a 13 hour time difference. Like it's hard to sleep and it's hard to get back on track, bro. Just everything about this idea is hella smart, dog. If you got a dream, don't sleep, don't sleep, yeah. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. What you waiting on? You can do it. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, and he was just talking about Bobby Boucher right before that from Water from Waterboy, and then You Can't Do It from that guy. He's like, we suck again. <laughs> That's tight. Man, Japan just looks so chill. And these type of videos where they like where they're wide angle lens, you don't hear any of the audio is kind of just it's almost like just a highlight reel of what they did in Japan. That shit is that's nostalgic, dog. Like I wasn't even there and I feel nostalgic about the trip because of the video. Do it. What you waiting on? My name is Words, last name is Blade. He kinda strange. Let me explain. Love yeah. by many, secretly loved by more. Opportunity was late, so I went to its door. I love you. Waiting for it to open. It's Opportunity was late, so I went to its door waiting for it to open. Like, bro, I didn't I, I went to go get the opportunity that I saw. I didn't wait I didn't wait back and let that come to me. If you wait for something to happen, you might be waiting forever. You gotta go get that shit, dog. That was fire. And these little annotations right here on his part, worst play lives in San Diego during World War II. Japan planned a bio attack on San Diego with plague infested fleas. <laughs> And y'all, that would have sucked. But also, that's why we dropped two nukes. <laughs> well, I went to its door, I love you. waiting for it to open. It's taking too long. Feel like Jay in the elevator with Solange. I'll let yeah. him keep the bad uh, contracts and think. It's taking too long. I, I felt like Jay waiting in the elevator with Solange, bro. Remember when Jay Z and Beyonce and Solange were in the elevator? She started beating his ass. Like. This is a long ass elevator ride for that for all that to be happening. It's like you're riding a like you're riding a bull. That six seconds, that eight seconds, got to take forever. Like Jay in the elevator with Solange. I'll let yeah. him keep the bad contracts and finger food. I'll take my family at Emmy and an art wall interview. I love you. Wonder Ooh. if the teachers knew I'd go from the school doc to triple platinum on the TikTok. Yeah. Still disrupting their class. I go from that school class. I go from the school clown dog. Like it's kind of like the cool thing to do in school, but teachers obviously hate that. Like they hate that. Shit. But who would have thought that I went from the school clown to like not knowing where my life is to all of a sudden ending up full time doing what I love to do on YouTube? Like that's crazy. And he's saying the same thing basically. Who knew that I go from that to like pl triple platinum on TikTok? From the school doc to triple platinum on the TikTok. Ah. Yeah, <laughs> disrupting their classes. Blessings to the masses. Check the data. I'm trying to get to one Rockefeller Plaza. Oh, bro, I just, I just realized that he said still dis disrupting their classes. Like he was, he was a class clown disrupting their classes when he was in school. Now he's triple platinum on TikTok, and TikTok is once again disrupting those same classes by kids being on their phone. Bro, that's a bar. For sure. The data, I'm trying to get to one rock I love you. plaza. Gotta keep on the lights till I'm coming at them live on a Saturday night. Ah. Like, hit them up, hit them up, hit them up. Till I'm coming live on a Saturday night, like Saturday Night Live, keep the lights on. And I gotta like go back and read all these little things. What did I miss? Ramen is actually Chinese and was introduced in Japan only a hundred years ago. They ate ramen every single day on their trip. This is Golden Guy. I assume that's how it's pronounced, Gay. An area of six alleys with almost 200 tiny bars. Bro, that's dope. During the trip, Alex Medina preferred bookstores over bars. It's fine too. I'm sure there's hella vintage bookstores and like just aesthetic AF. Hit him up, hit him up, hit him up, hit him up. Watch how they keep it and coming up. Count it up, count it up. Look at this girl, don't be running up. If you got a dream, don't sleep on it. If you got a dream, don't sleep. Yeah, if you got a dream, don't sleep on it. If you got a dream, don't sleep, don't sleep. Yeah, do it, do it, do it, do it. What you waiting on? You can do it. That's why 
why it's got like that. That's why it's got that fisheye lens. I was I was wondering if they were like on a DSLR, like what I'm shooting on right now, with like an ultra wide, like eight millimeter lens that gives it that fish fisheye distortion. You don't need a three thousand, four thousand dollar setup in order to make like a dope ass video. You know, you can get a little three hundred and fifty dollar GoPro and you're fine. What you waiting on? You can do it. Yeah. Do it. Do it. What you waiting on? I feel like more people buy Japan. Fire. Japan. Fire. Yo, I feel like I feel like more people need to do that with the sh with like the things that they uh I'm, I'm trying to like cut back on the cussing because I know that's not the demographic, but like uh I feel like more people need to do that with the pictures that they take and with the video that they take on their phone. So they need to like turn it into something so everybody can see like who who cares about a picture that you took if it's just sitting in your phone, like basically in phone purgatory. Put Do something, we need, need to print those out, put them in a slideshow, put music to it, make a video with it, make videos of the trip, like, like semi vlog your trip, not to like be a huge YouTube vlog sensation, just like just that way you have something to go and remember your trip by. You can always go back and look on it. I have a I have a New York video for me and my parents or me and my mom and uh, my aunt. I have a New York edit in this channel specifically just for that. And then on top of that, I have like an EDC video where me and my brother in like 2017, the EDC back then is like a recap video also to music, also muted just like this. It's just that way we could relive those memories. What's the point of taking pictures and, and video if they're just gonna stay on your phone, you know? But this whole video, everything about it was just a vibe, the chill nature of the song, the very unprofessional looking video in terms of like, he didn't, they weren't really lining up angles. They didn't really care about like the, the cinematography aesthetic of it. And that has its own aesthetic built in like naturally by having like very rough footage because you're not doing it. You're just doing it for yourself and for your friends. And that looks dope. I'm still like enamored with like how fire this concept is. Just fire. But yo, that brings us to the end of this video, ladies and gentlemen. If you like what you see, please consider liking the video, leaving a comment down below. If you like what you see enough, please consider subscribing. If you like what you see enough for sure, for sure, and you want extra like content, you want to connect with me directly, you want exclusive videos, those kind of things, early release to certain videos that will hit the channel, go check out and subscribe to the Patreon at whatever tier you would like to. Because that Patreon is what helps keeps me here because I'm full time. I'm full time on YouTube specifically because of the Patreon and what they saw in me to not let the channel just fall apart so potentially thinking about becoming a patreon you're paying my bills and you're getting extra extra content for your membership follow your boy on instagram and on twitter at the third earnest just like the channel links are down in the description below hit up the discord also linked in the description below but that brings us to the end of our video ladies and gentlemen i appreciate your time go out there in the world love and care for one another love and care for each other and i'll catch everybody on the next video peace Everyone, everyone smile for the family photo But everyone, everyone ain't always in the picture